Okay, hi guys. So, this is my fifth time trying to record this video today. I am trying to show you guys what is in my planner bag and just overall all the planner things I'm going to be bringing on my trip because I'm going to be traveling this summer. So, let's try this one more time. Last time my camera just cut off mysteriously because I'm using my iPhone and apparently I didn't have enough storage. So, I just went back and deleted a lot of photos and videos. So, Let's hope it won't cut off this time. Okay, so now for the planners that I'll actually be bringing on my trip, I'm bringing my Heidi Swap Memory Planner, which I haven't started using this yet because it is June 29th and I'm going to start actually writing in this planner July 1st. But this is basically how it's set up. It's pretty blank. I wanted to save everything until I start actually using it. And then my beloved Happy Planner, which has been getting a lot of Instagram love. So I'm going to show you guys a quick through. This is my July Monthly. And you can see this is the Scotch Airplane Washi Tape that I got from Target. It just marks off the two weeks that I will be traveling this summer. And this is this week. I am leaving the 5th, so this Sunday. And today is the 29th, this Monday. You actually probably won't be seeing this video until the 5th because I think I'm going to put this up as a plan with me Sunday <laughs> so that's my happy planner the only thing that couldn't fit in my planner bag that I'm bringing you know besides my planners that I shall be bringing planner wise is my Zywon Creator sticker this is the two and a half inch with one with the crank and I just like using this instead of using my adhesive roller on certain stickers like the stickers I cut out to put in my day to day planner I like to use this creative sticker instead of my Zyron not my Zyron instead of my adhesive roller so I am bringing this it'll just go in my suitcase and then for the actual bag that I'll be bringing this is the basics bag from Bed Bath & Beyond and it's just a clear bag and I got it for ten dollars so Let's just jump in because I'm trying to get, now I'm trying to kind of rush this video because I want to make sure it actually gets filmed. So in this front pocket right here, you can see it's a pocket separate from everything in the main compartment. And that is where I keep all my dollar sticker books. So these are the five that I own from Michaels and I was so happy I posted a picture on Instagram about how I finally found sticker books and I found some really good ones in my eyes. So I got this Wise University one. These cute owls just dressed up in school stuff and wearing grad caps and I got this Anchors Away which is this really nice nautical theme one as you can see it's just really nice I have this poolside pops and more sticker book which is very much summer themed just thought this was adorable with all the cute animals wearing sunglasses and stuff I got this ride my bike one with all these adorable animals riding bikes <laughs> very self-explanatory <laughs> and then Mermaid Tales, which is just another, not nautical, but more under the sea theme. These cute mermaids and um, octopus and dolphins and turtles and stuff. So that's what I have in that front pocket. And then in the main compartment of the bag, I'm just going to start pulling stuff out. And this black Sephora bag I have here. I just have most of my like tool stuff, which I have my Elmer's adhesive roller, my an old Elta gift card, old old <laughs> my an old Ulta gift card that I use to cut washi. I have my Fisker's heart punch, which I'm also gonna be being be bringing a regular one fourth circle punch, but this is just one of the punches I have in here. Don't have that whole punch in here, the regular circle one in here yet. And then I have all of my pens. So I'm bringing a lot of my Sharpie Ultra Fine Permanent Markers, which is not focusing, but I use these to um, write on washi tape and write on stickers. And then I have a couple medium tip paper mate flares 
and then I'm bringing all of my medium tip paper mate ink joy pens so have all of that and blar this bag and then in this sparkly Ulta not Ulta Ipsy bag I think this was the January December Ipsy bag of 2014 I have all the washi tapes I'm bringing, which is quite obsessive. Obsessive, I will admit. I'm bringing six for two weeks. But um, in my mind, it's all justified. So just listen to my excuses that I came up with. <laughs> I'm bringing this pink scotch washi tape to use in my How Do You Swap Memory Planner because the color schemes are very pink, white, and black and with gold accents bringing this scotch striped washi tape which reminds me of a beach towel and we're going to the beach while we're there so this is appropriate <laughs> the scotch grass washi tape that I got at Target and it is just for to mark times that I know are going to be outside for extensive amounts of time I'm bringing this pink red and orange floral scotch washi tape that I also got at Target and also to use in my highly squat planner mainly, once again, to really go with the color scheme. I brought my Scotch Airplane Washi, which you saw in my July monthly. And I'm using this just because, you know, I'm bringing this because we're traveling. I thought it'd be appropriate. And then I brought my Scotch Polka Dot Washi, which reminds me a lot of parties. And we're having a couple parties while I'm away. So I thought this would be pretty awesome to bring to no parties. So there my excuses for all the washi <laughs> and that's just in this sparkly ipsy bag now for the things just floating around in my bag i have my sticker book and this is just a photo album that my friend gave me and i put all my stickers in it and i don't know where the photo album is from so i'm sorry about that i just have stickers in it these are the manby stickers from the happy planner set I have once again those cutouts that I run through my Xyron and these a lot of them are from Miss Wenda so all of these are from Miss Wenda this one I made myself these are Michelle XOXO logo stickers and these TV stickers I made myself Miss Wenda Miss Wenda Miss Wenda and then I get into the scrapbooking stickers which most of them I get from Walmart for 97 cents and then some of them I got from Michaels like this cute puppy set is from Michaels and there's like multiple little puppy stickers wearing like butterfly wings and stuff which is weird and random these two sets are from michael's and then walmart 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 oh these are little stickers that my planner buddy made with her silhouette and i used to be in a program with um called Schuler that does college readiness and these are the logos. So every time I had to do something for my college readiness program, I used to use these. I'm moving, so I'm no longer in that program, which is a little sad, but she made me those stickers, which was very nice of her. Thank you, Emily. And some more. These Instagram stickers I made myself. And then these are from Walmart. These are Michaels. They used to be 3D stickers, but I took the 3D backing off of them and ran them through my Zyron machine. These are from Sticky Wicked Designs. More Walmart. Walmart things I printed offline that, you know, embody what I'm going to be doing on my trip that I can run through my Xyron, letter stickers from Walmart, and then these adorable checklists from Hello Emily Co. that are made for the Happy Planner, which is awesome because not a lot of shops make Happy Planner stickers just yet, but these are checklists that fit in the Happy Planner, which you saw when I showed you this week in my Happy Planner for July, and it's just gorgeous. Oh, they're just amazing. I just absolutely love these and they're from hello emily co on etsy and they got instagram love this past week so that's just my sticker book also in here is this pack of um, designer construction paper and this is the six by six and it's from color book and then this is the carnival collection I suppose and it just had a lot of cute summer stick um, summer paper that I thought would be really nice if I wanted to add my own scrapbook layout 
in my Heidi Swap Memory Planner. I wouldn't even have to measure this because it would fit nicely in there. And I can just put pictures or journal cards or whatever else I want on my spread and then hole punch them and slip them right into my Heidi Swap Memory Planner. So I'm bringing this along. So it's like I said, in case I want to add any more pictures that don't like fit in the little individual day boxes, I can make my own spreads. And I thought that was awesome. I got that at Walmart for $3. And then finally, the last, well actually no, wait <laughs> scissors and then the last thing on my um whew, sorry then the last thing on my in my planner bag is excuse my hand for a second are my journal cards which I just put in this ziplock bag and a lot of them are from we are memory keepers if I could get them out from the We Are Memory Keepers travel set. Got these, this cute suitcase one, and this Our Great Adventure one, which on the back of this suitcase one is this one. I got just a lot of journal cards from that set, the We Are Memory Keepers set I got at Walmart for $5, and it was just the journal cards. And then I have some printout ones that I printed out on my printer onto cardstock paper and cut myself and these are from mistina.blogspot.com and I will link those below and <laughs> this video will be having an accompanying blog post so if you want to see more up close pictures on some of the journal cards you can look there. I also got have and also in the packing these really cute 3 by 4 envelopes that you can just like decorate and then punch into my high slot planner you know just keep whatever you want in there so these are the four by six cards from your memory keepers the three by four pockets these are the four by six cards by miss tina and then some three by four cards from miss tina well, those are from not for miss tina <laughs> ah, i'm trying to get these all out let's just dump whoa so these are like the 3x4 by, by Miss Tina. And then these are the 3x4 by, by VR Memory Keepers. And that is it. That is all the crap that I am bringing with me planner-wise. foot. But I am very, you know, satisfied. A lot of my friends didn't think I'd be able to fit everything into this one bag. But I pretty much showed them. And this is just, you know, I feel like it's a healthy amount because I'm going to be planning and scrapbooking and I just never know what I'm going to want to do one day. So I tried to keep it to a minimum, which is why I bought such a small bag. I see other people on planner YouTube who buy like bags. I have like four pockets that are just about the size of this and it opens up and then there's mini pockets. And I just wanted to have a simple bag and keep everything I need in it. So that's it. Um, I hope you guys have a wonderful Sunday and I will see you guys later.